Hi, this is Ali at SafeNet and talking about the envelope. So the envelope I can uh, run it from here from the vendor suite. And when the envelope opens up I might see uh, that there are three different types of uh, envelope uh, types like uh, Java envelope, Windows uh, 32, 64 uh, ones and .NET. Um, so there are three engines, different engines that, that are working uh, behind this uh, application uh, and this envelope as a matter of fact as we said is the tool in which you take your application and at the end of this process of protecting it with this envelope it will become a protected application. So, uh, instead of talking too much, uh, let's see what, what, it, what it does. So, uh, the very first thing that I have to do when I enter into this envelope is to add uh, an executable DLL or something that I want to protect it. So, I can do it uh, from here at Program. Uh, by default, I'm, I'm uh, suggested to go to a place where we have samples. These are samples that are provided as part of the LDK um, and you can use them for protection with the envelope for instance. Let me take for instance Win32 Bounce which is a Windows 32 a PE. So this, this is being added and if I click on the file itself I can see that the input file is here. The output file meaning where is going to be the protected file. So maybe I will go to put it in the desktop and perhaps in order to make sure that it is protected I will maybe change the name of it into Pro, like protected. So I know that on the desktop the Pro Win32 Bounce will be the protected or the enveloped application. Next, um, I'm not going to elaborate on everything because uh, this is not relevant for now but what is important to know is that always when you protect something uh, you have to say which feature is going to be searched in the key uh, in order for this uh, application, this protected application to be working. The default is zero meaning that it's going to look for feature number zero uh, over here. Uh, so let me maybe change it uh, into uh, 55. I want to lock it to feature 55 which means that the protected application will look for feature 55 always when it, uh, it runs. So just protect and it is done. What, what was happening is that a new file, here it is, Pro Win32 Bounce uh, is, uh, is going to be here uh, as the protected application and in addition to it there is additional file ASPRT uh, which is uh, part of the runtime but we don't have to elaborate on it now. So if I click on, double click on it, first uh, message that I'm going to have is a message that telling me that uh, this is only for demo demonstration. And this is, the reason for that is because for practicing and demonstrating we, we use um, a demo kit. Uh, but once you are going to use your own patch code you will not see this message. So I can ignore it. And then I get an error that feature uh, is not found. The feature number 55 that I uh, locked this envelope enveloped application uh, that is not is not here. So let me maybe see what are the features that I do have on this machine. How do you know which features exist on this machine? I opened the admin control center as we said localhost 1947 and over here I can see that there is a key. This key and if I go to features I can see what are the features that it has. Uh, unfortunately I see only that it has it has feature number zero. So let's 
lock again uh, the application, but now let's use feature zero. Protect. So once again, I have uh, the Win32 Bounce Pro, and if I double click on it, now it finds the zero, and it's working. This is the application, just a, a jumping ball. Um, let maybe we want to see if feature number zero is really being uh, used. So in order to see so, what I will do, I will go to the ACC once again to Sentinel Keys and I see that there is one session. The session uh, is because there is a login uh, to feature. Let me see which features and I see that feature number zero has one login because the envelope, once it runs, it uses feature zero. It looks for feature zero and use it. So this feature zero stays and now maybe let me show you if I stop the running feature zero uh, login and session is, is uh, ended. ended. Uh, so the enveloped application does not work right now and this is why. So in short the envelope is the tool to protect an application and to lock it to a specific feature that I want to lock it. Thank you for watching.